Good morning, happy Vlogmas day five. It's Thursday, I just have Chinese class today and then I have work, so it's keeping it light today. I do want to do another blog, but I also really want to memorize my Chinese presentation because it's due on Monday. So I really need to focus on that as well today, but today is just a light day. There's nothing much going on today. There really is nothing much going on today. I don't know what the plan is after school, but I feel like we're gonna go. We're gonna come back and just relax. I feel like it's one of those days that is well deserved and we're just all exhausted. We're super tired. We've been staying up late, which is really bad, but at the same time, like, we've just been grinding because it's finals, so we gotta grind, you know? It's not fun. Not fun at all. Gotta take the dogs out and then after we're gonna go make our cup of coffee and our HG1. Ooh. Okay. Allergy season. HG1. Another day, another HG1. One scoop into this. We add some water to the container. And then we shake up the bottle. My favorite day of the day. Cheers. Okay, let's make a morning coffee. Now that's the favorite part of my day. Cup of ice. Let's see what flavor I should use today. I'm thinking of doing golden caramel again. I love this flavor, it's so good. I got it yesterday, so tasty, I'm obsessed. I'm so excited for this cup of coffee, you have no idea. I was up till 2 in the morning, I was editing my vlog, and then I was trying to get it uploaded by, like, before the day ended, but it ended up going all the way to, like, 1 in the morning, and then I ended up also taking a final as well, so I only have two more classes left, I just realized. I took my three finals already, so my fashion diversity class final, my fashion... I have another fashion class, but I don't remember what it's called. I think it's, like, fashion history. So took my building digital audiences final already so my last two finals are all written and online so one is my journalism final and then also one is my chinese final and i'm not looking forward to those because i don't want to take them ah uh, there's just so much so much studying but it's okay they're all next week so we have a little bit of time to just memorize zone in and just make sure I get a good grade because I need a C plus or higher in my journalism class and then I just need to pass with a B for my Chinese class. That's what's up! Literally I was kind of afraid that I wasn't going to score well but I scored pretty well. I scored a 94% and I like it took like it was 85 questions 85 minutes and I was able to finish it um within an hour, so it was actually not that bad, but yay for me. Um, I don't know what my presentation grades are, but I'm hoping they're good, because the professors like me, and I, I'm so scared to find out what I'm gonna get for my Chinese and journalism finals. You guys, I'm kind of obsessed with this new desk setup. You guys saw yesterday in Vlogmas that I got some new accessories for the desk, because I definitely wanted to um, organize everything. But look, okay, so I put the laptop stand down, and then I also started organizing my cables. So the cables are definitely more organized. And then I also got a headphone stand, and it is so cute to just put my little AirPod Maxes on it. And I don't know, the desk is just so much more free. We're charging our laptops for school, but I don't know. I love it. I love the like, the, just the look to it. And we are a little office desk chair, but overall, it's just such an overall, such a cute. I'm a really firm believer in uh, believing in building your workspace and making sure that your desk space is what you want. Cause definitely it helps motivate you to go work. It helps motivate you to just grind. And if you have an organized desk, it just, I don't know. It just helps clear the mind a little bit more. and. And for me, I love to decorate. I love interior design. So one of the things that I really wanted to focus on was making sure that my desk was minimal. It was organized. It was something that I could make use out of it every single day. And I was able to do that. And I was so glad that like it turned out the way it is. I do wish that we did have like a sit-stand desk, but it is a bit expensive and a little bit out of my price range right now. So we're... Oh, 
Okay, so we're seeing what we can do about it, but for now we're just gonna keep the dining table because I feel like we just bought the dining table and I feel like it does its job and it does what it needs to do and it is to be a desk. <laughs> All right, now we're waiting for Jacob to get ready and then we're heading to school. It is currently 8.45, so he is on a time crunch because we need to get to school soon. We're heading to the car. We charged our car yesterday night because our car was about to die and uh, there was no charging spot. So Jacob had to go in like the middle of the night in order to even charge the car, which is not fun, but you know, it is what it is. You got to do what you got to do in order to get that Tesla charged up. But now we're heading over to school. Also, look how cute Jacob's outfit is today. Let's head to school. The things that I'm focusing on right now is looking over my Chinese presentation. I'm writing out all the pinging that I don't know. And then for some reason, somehow, I'm going to try to memorize all of this by Monday. And I might make a presentation just to help me. But I'm kind of scared. There's a lot of words that I need to memorize. And I don't know if I could do it. I feel like one of the hardest parts about memorizing is literally taking it word for word and trying to memorize every single word and i don't know if i can make a presentation for it so i'm gonna make one just in case and then if i can't use it then i'm gonna hope that i memorized everything but i'm gonna bring this up with me and hope for the best <laughs> Honestly, I have no idea if this vlog is going to be long or not, so I'm hoping that it's actually a good length. I feel like today is definitely such a chill day. I'm basically just at work for most of it, and we're going home. I feel like we're not doing much today, except we're going to a bar maybe tonight, but I don't know if I'm going to vlog that, because I definitely want to try to get this vlog up before the day ends, but if I do choose to vlog it, I'll probably end up editing it and uploading it after the bar or tomorrow morning, which you guys will see whenever it comes we just got back home we are tired we are exhausted we're gonna rest a little and then after i think we're going out to alexander still but i'm gonna make a little june 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 oh, pop i don't know it's really, 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 it's really really good surprisingly it's basically like me and bagogi like a rice ball i don't know but next time i go to trader joe's i'm getting this again they're so good i love it and it's just so easy you pop in the microwave for a minute and 20 and it's just done just finished heating it up. I also put some cheese puffs in there because I love cheese puffs. But this is what it looks like and it's so good. Let's try a little bit of the little rice ball. Mmm. It like reminds me of those like Asian rice balls that you can get at like um at like dim sum and oh god. Mmm. 